guys, it's Rachel again. Um, this is my second video ever. Um, I just made my skincare video, so go check that out if you haven't watched it yet. Um, so I guess I could say a little bit about myself, considering I didn't do that in the first video. My name's Rachel, I'm 20 years old, um, and I live in the U.S., uh, Colorado to be exact, um, and makeup's just my hobby. Um, I don't know, it's kind of something fun I started playing around with. So, um, I'm going to do a favorites video now. Now we know it's already in well into August, but it's just going to be stuff I've really been using um, in July a lot. So, I'll kind of put those out. They're pretty much all beauty products. Um, so yeah, I'll just start going through those quickly. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, so first off, um, I guess I'll do, I guess I'll do like more random stuff. Um, I guess I have two hair products that I've really been liking. Um, Aussie Mega Hairspray in Flexible Hold. Um, it's like $4.50 at the drugstore. I got it from my grocery store. And, um, I really, really, really like this stuff because it smells good. It doesn't make your hair crunchy. It, um, holds really well. It holds a couple days, in fact. Um, so yeah, I just really like this. Um... And I haven't even gone through the whole bottle yet. I bought a backup, so we'll see how long it takes me to go through this huge one. So, loving that. Another hair product is my Pantene Style Pro V Curls Mousse um, Extra Strong Hold. Again, I, I have wavy hair, and so when I'm out of the shower and I don't really want to straighten it or whatever, um, it's very messed today. It's like, I don't know. Um, it's all up in the back and it's a mess, but oh well. Anyway, um,. I use this when I scrunch my hair and I don't know, I really like it. It smells good again. Um, it does not frizz. It does um, not get crunchy or anything like that. So I'm really liking this as well. I'm using this quite a bit. Okay, this is not even a hair or makeup product, but I've been loving it. Black raspberry and vanilla soap. It smells so good. Mmm. I don't know, I just love it. As you can see, I've used a good amount of it, but I just keep this in my bathroom with uh, my hand soap, so. I don't know, I know it's kind of random, but it smells really, really good. I bought it for like 88 cents. Okay, so for the makeup products, I don't really have that many, but. Oh, grab them. Okay. So first, on um, my MAC 222 brush, it's kind of dirty because I used it today. But, um, I really, really like this. Um, just for, I've been using it in my crease and blending out and blending up. Um, I don't know. I've really, really been liking this because I don't have huge eyes and so this works better than the 224 for me. So, I just, I don't know. I've really been loving this. I need to do this almost every day. Um, favorite mascara. I go through mascara a lot. Um, I'm really into the CoverGirl Lash Blast waterproof one, but I like this one even more. And this one is MAC Zoom Lash. This is just the baby sample. I don't know if you can see that or if it's going to show up. But, um, brush looks like this. You can see that. So, I don't know. I like it. It's very, con it's very easy to use, very controlled, and it's my lashes really long, yet, um, makes them volumized as well. So it's not waterproof, which is kind of a downfall. I don't know, I really like waterproof mascaras, but really been liking it. It's in Zoom Black. Um, so yeah, if you go on MAC, um, the MAC's website, and you use in the discount code LASH69, you get free shipping and a free sample of these. So I have a few of these lying around, so I'm going to use these up before I buy the full size, but I will be buying the full size. Um, I guess this is a combination I've really been liking for my cheeks. I've really been liking this Maybelline New York in Precious Pink. Looks like that. Um, I put that all over uh, apples in my cheeks and up. And then on the main apples in my cheeks, I concentrate on there. This is a regular blush brush for this. And, um, like the 150. And then I use my 187. Um, this is the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Petticoat. 
when using that one, I put this on my cheeks, um, just to kind of give a little glow, but not too much. So I'm really liking this combination. I don't know why. I just tried it one day, and I've been using it every day. Okay. Um, one or three more things, I guess. This is just a quad from a drugstore, Maybelline. Um, I've been using this a lot. I really like it. I've only been using the lid color, the crease color, and the brow bone, brow bone color. Just because this outer corner color, the dark one right here, <coughs> is really not very pigmented. And, um, yeah, see, look. Can you even barely see that? Like, look how dark it shows up on there. Um, let's just see the outer corner color, but it just does not show up. So, in place of that, I've been using a hip. I'm sure about that, but it was ju it's just a hip L'Oreal um, eyeshadow with purple color. I can't even think of exactly what one is. It's out of the duo wicket, the purple and that. So, I've been using that in place of that. But I've been loving this. Um, so, I've been using this a lot for work. So, it gives me some pop of color, but not too much. Alright, and last but not least, my MAC um, Satin Taupe, which is that color right there. I don't know how well you can see that, but um, oh, I've been loving this. That and Espresso, which is right next to it, um, for the crease color. So, uh, Satin Taupe all over the lid, Espresso in the crease, and I've just been loving that. And I guess, okay, I guess I have one more. Brulee, which is right here. It's just a nice um, matte satin uh, eyeshadow that I use a highlight as a highlight. It uh, just really mattifies everything to get a lot of going on in the lid. Um, so those are my favorites. Um, I hope you guys like that. And um, if you guys want to do video response, love to see it. Love to see what your favorites are. Um, again, subscribe, comment, and rate. Um, and let me guys know what you guys want to see. Um, wow, that didn't make, not make any sense. Let me know what you guys want to see. So you can comment down below or message me um, with video requests or tutorials or whatever it may be. Whether it's, you know, I don't know. So anyway, um, thanks guys for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.